to Tokyo for a while. Look up here though. Don't know when or why. I miss the lights. The only animals I to deal with were the street rats. There's to be rivals, fighting each other for the street vendors, dumps or food. That changed my mind. I met Hero. He was a mean competitive. Mind some crying. Scurried past me with a half needle, takoyaki, some butt must have dropped on the way back to the apartment. But I saw him, I saw the scrap of food he was carrying. Then he stopped and turned to look at me. He was so alright, bother to look at me unless he was trying to fight. I stopped and looked. His empathy was pouring out his eyes like the tears from mine. We stared at each other for almost a minute. He crept back timidly. Then he dropped the dregs of what was probably to be his family supper on my feet. He quickly paced away. But I said, hey, wait, stop. He turned around. Thank you. He nodded, still staring. What's your name? I said. He stood on his hind paws and pointed to this brick wall across from me. Where some graffiti writers scribbled the word hero. I glanced at the wall, glanced back at him, and said, Thanks, hero. You're one of the good ones. He nodded again. He stood back up and pointed to the sky. I'm not sure if he was pointing at the moon, or maybe a constellation. I can't see many stars in Tokyo anyway. But I replied with a little laugh. <laughs> okay, I'll see you there. Then he went four-legged and left. So I sat and said to myself, Tomorrow, same time, same place. Maybe we can even find something fresh to eat. I ate his gift and slept against the wall. And then I woke up here. Still don't know how. <laughs> Still don't know why.